Hello, I'm IBX Tiger, and this is my new Title Update 12 Let's Play. A uh, Let's Play on Title Update 12, obviously. And uh, this is using the Seed IBX Jungle just to go right off the bat because that was a seed I did a video on a while ago for P when it was on PC only. And I was like, "You will spawn in a jungle." Everyone's like, "No, the seed's changed." And I was like, "Yeah, look at me, I'm right. You spawn right in a jungle." So IBX Jungle, that's the seed I'm using, and it's gonna be a Title Update 12 Let's Play doing Title Update 12 y things. And uh, this is Episode One, as you can probably guess from the fact that you haven't seen an episode before, uh, and slash or the fact that I just said it was episode one you know one of those two things probably tipped you off uh, this is oak wood so now i've got some of this uh so since it is uh, Title 12, that means there's now four types of wood. Uh, there are cocoa beans to get, there are iron golems to do, uh, there's a lot of new stuff to do, uh, as well as just, you know, new ideas that I've come up with in the time, and it should be a fun let's play, and... Uh, as always, if you want to contribute to the Let's Play, I do read the comments on every episode, so if you have any crazy ideas, if you think I'm doing something and could be doing it better, uh, you can always just comment and let me know, and then I will obviously work on the feedback and stuff and try and do that. Uh, so the first thing I want to do is I want to find myself uh, my setup my house, because what I want to do is find loads of uh, tall jungle trees, uh, somewhat near the same height, uh, very close together. Those four look pretty good, actually, uh, because I want to make a house that's on top of all of them and sort of links to webbed with them. I want to do something clever with shears, and uh, get that going. Uh, so I think I'm going to make one of... Th yeah, I think these four are going to be my house. Uh, I don't know whether to keep the trees nearby them or not. Because uh, this is close to a regular biome as well. That's uh, This is where the jungle biome ends. And then there's a regular biome over there for some reason. Uh, no idea what's in there, but we're going to find that out later. Uh, or... We could head over there and see if they're a more viable alternative. Because there's four just over there as well. Um... You know, actually, yeah, those are those are a little too close together, so what we'll do is we'll just uh, punch down from this tree. Because uh, I believe I'm standing on a jungle tree right now. I, I could be wrong. Let's quickly punch this, see what it is. Uh, is this oak or is this jungle? This is oak. There's a lot of oak in the jungle, by the way. So, yeah, uh, and since this is, this, as I said, there's four types of wood, I think I'm going to start collecting lots and lots of different types of wood because, uh, you know, just, uh, you want to have a bit of all the types of wood because they all have their own little charms for building and, I don't know, some people are really fussy and stuff, some people aren't. Uh, all I know is I just, ooh, apple. Yeah, I got the apple. It's it's worth taking the damage. Uh, all I know is I just want to live tonight properly. Also, I want to take some coke beans. So I'm just going to try and find those as I go around. And just have a generally good time. Also, punching cow stuff for your fist takes quite a while. I think it's like seven or eight hits. Uh, it's pretty ridiculous. It might even be more than that, apparently. Um, so, you know, just pro tip for your first night. Punching cows is difficult. Uh, sheep, on the other hand, it's only about five or six. So it's like, yeah. Just going to go ahead and kill them. Nice and easy, get myself the wool I need, my bed. Uh, I think tonight I actually might do the spider technique, just because that's something uh, a lot of people don't know about. That you, Oh, God, that went strange. Uh, that you can actually use um, spider... Sorry, not spider. Uh, you can kill spiders and then use string to turn that into wool for a bed. Uh, that's a little pro tip for, you know, sleeping that a lot of people don't know about. So I might use that if I don't see enough sheep. Uh, I, I do enjoy doing that sort of, you know, off the wall. Well, it's not really off the wall, but that sort of different stuff, you know, keeping myself differentiated from everyone else. Uh, it's just a little interesting, in my opinion. So that's what I'm going to do. So... Yeah, we've got ourselves eight oak wood and some jungle wood. Now I'm going to go to the jungles of the, the trees over there uh, because it's all the ones I was speaks, you know, pointing at earlier, and then we should be all good and dandy. Um, you know, I could also try and grow my own jungle trees, although that does get a bit messy, so I'm not entirely convinced I'm going to be doing that that much. Uh, but yeah, we're going to look over here, see if these trees look about the same height. Uh, they're not that tall, I don't think these are the ones I was looking at from a distance. Though we could climb one because they do have vines and a look at the top from them. We'll, we'll see what we'll do. So we'll jump on here, jump up to over there. I don't think we can actually make that, so we'll just we'll just give it a quick eyeball. These four look really close together and not too crazy high up. Uh, so who knows if I'll do it. I'll, I'll try and find some that are higher up, maybe on a hill somewhere. Uh, again, look, at, look how high those look. I, I like the idea of being over there because... I want to have my house on top of a jungle tree because uh, I want to make use of the new height limit and just build something crazy high but I want to have my default level of my house uh, on top of something that's already just uh, insanely high uh, so it looks like we're going to be climbing this and we're going to be giving it a little eyeball because uh, that's how ooh, that's how you got to do things it's a little difficult to climb trees when they're like this you have to sort of crouch a little go, go to the right and then okay let's go no right I want to no not not up right oh it, it's working somehow I, I don't know how I just did that but I did um, go out of crouch mode, then we'll give it a look. So, it seems this is, eh, we're on a hill, so it's, it's not that good. It seems like you just built it right next to it. So we're going to head over to this one, and we're going to give this one a look. Uh, again, we've we got to try and get the perfect uh, thing, by the way. Uh, and also, yeah, again, if you want to play along with me and do that sort of stuff, that's something a lot of people enjoy doing my Let's Plays, so you can always do that. So, 
going to continue climbing this, or looking around. Uh, I've sprinted a lot, so I'm actually using up a lot of my hunger. Uh, but again, that's something I can deal with because I've got an apple. I've got some raw beef that I can cook. It's all good, so... You know, I think I'm going to have to call that one my house because it's, it's still quite tall and it's on top of a uh, hill anyway, so we're at Y99 as it is. Uh, that'll be somewhere in the Y120, so we'll be able to build something quite tall. Uh, then it'll just be about building a pathway to it, clearing the jungle, making something really cool. Uh, that's what it's all going to be about, so yeah, I, I can approve of that. Going with the uh, pretty low level trees here, but it's it's worth it, so... Uh, let's let's go to one that seems like it's closest towards the edge or closest towards something else. Um, what's to the north here? There's just more water, so we're going to have to build something. Yeah, I, I think it's good. Uh, which tree should be the starting tree, though? Uh, this one seems the easy... No, that's not good. Wine's going all the way to the top. Either does this, really. We need one that's just a nice, easy climb. Uh, I don't want to be caught off guard by a skeleton and just killed in the night, because, you know, that's, that's not fun at all. Um... Oh, and another little fun fact about this world is I'm going to be playing on normal because uh, basically I just eh, I, I, I've done a let's play on easy, which was the update adventures. I've done one, I've done quite a few on hard actually. I figured I would just uh, keep things fresh on the, or make something different and go straight to uh, what do you call it? Uh, whatever we're on now, normal. I don't know how it took me so long to work that out. Uh, so again, these these trees are tempting too. I think that's going to be a good starting one. Uh, oh, that that one over there is very tall, but it's not as tall as these ones. So I think this this tree right here, yeah, this this tree is gonna be the home base. Uh, then it will, you know, there'll be stairs leading up to those ones, uh, and then also it'll be difficult to climb up this one. Uh, it'll make it look really impressive once everything's sorted out. I could get up the hill if it makes everything look unimpressive. Uh, who knows? But first of all, we need to get our you know first night going. So first of all, we'll make a crafting bench with the like, oak wood planks. Uh, place that down uh, right over here. Then we need to make some flooring. Uh, we'll use jungle wood. You know, let's use jungle wood itself uh, rather than the planks because it looks nicer. Uh, as, as much of a waste as you probably consider that to be, it just it's just got that tiny bit of nicing look. Uh, we'll also put a little jungle wood thing in the corner over here. Um, the corner over here. Eh, eh, I'm trying to work out the exact uh, you know specifications of how wide and stuff this is going to be, but I think I'll actually have uh, I'll have one just here for now. Uh, then I'm going to cover in coca beans, because this is how you farm coca beans, you just sort of leave them there. Uh, and this is going to be my coca beans farm, so I don't have to bother going out and looking for them. In fact, I'll do it too high so I can have uh, all the coca beans I have on there. Uh, then I'll slowly just collect coca beans over and over again there. Uh, now we need to get a bed sorted, because uh, a bed is an important part of the night. Uh, and also I'll get all these oak woods turned into oak wood planks, because they're here. Yeah, it's a little thing. So, I actually just redecided now. I'm going to have uh, oak wood flooring in this house because uh, it's it's just on top of a tree. It doesn't have to be necessarily. You know, what, let's 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 work out the exact entrance for this. Is there any easy vines to climb this one to? to uh, on climb onto this for? Uh, it doesn't seem there is, so I'm actually just going to have a ladder system in place. The sort, of... or, or maybe there's a way to get vines in creative. Let's see what happens when you punch them. You don't. I mean, in survival, uh, I might need to get a silk touch and do that later. Uh, but for the for now, I'll just have a ladder on that side of the house. Um, this side over here, uh, and then I guess this will be my door. Is that a good door? I guess where the crafting bench is right now will have to be the door actually, so we'll move the crafting bench. Uh, this is where the door will be, so place the crafting bench, bow, uh, place crafting bench back down over... Ooh, it's a hard place. We'll pull it, you know, just over here for now, and then um, this will be the door basically, and then we're going to use jungle wood for the outside, so it still looks like a tree sort of thing on the outside, and then on the inside we'll have oak wood planks. Uh, like this, and they, it should be a nice contrast. Uh, and then we'll just quickly just do some more of this so you get the basic idea. And then we need to put a door here, obviously, because otherwise stuff can get in. And uh, then we'll just have a really nice little tree, uh, tree house. Um, I haven't gone underground at all yet because that's not my main concern. My main concern is getting a house set up. Uh, usually I do like to rush straight to the stone tools so I don't have to use, uh, you know, wooden axes and stuff, but that's, that's a concern I'm not having to worry about today, so. Yeah, we've got this going quite well and nicely. So we've run out of jungle wood because obviously I'm using the actual wood. Uh, it's pretty expensive or not expensive, but you know the word I'm looking for to use. Uh, and now we're going to have to make ourselves a... I, we'll make the pickaxe now since you always need that anyway. And we'll also make a sword because we'll have to go out and kill spiders to make ourselves a bed. Uh, which we actually have the exact number of, uh, the exact right number to make. So that's, uh, that's convenient right there. And then we'll also plant one of... We don't need to plant these right now actually. Uh, though I would like to make a chest so we could go chop something down. Um... Yeah, we could we could really go chop down some trees, uh, jungle wood trees, because we've got quite a few nearby uh, that we need to get rid of. Or we don't need to get rid of them, but they're 
I know the ones that are in the way we sort of do, the ones that intimidate my tree collection, those are going to be mine. So anything that sort of, you know, overcomes that or... You know what, let's, sh let's chop down those two trees there because they're sort of... A, they're not an eyesore, but they're... You know, they get in the way of my stuff, which isn't what I want. So yeah, and then in the while that happens, something presumably uh, the nighttime stuff starts, and we'll see a spider somewhere. We'll have to kill it. Uh, worst case scenario, we see zombies, and they give us food because, as you can see, we're sort of low on the fooding thing right now. Uh, it's not it's not going quite so well as far as food is concerned because I, I've been concerned about getting my house set up first today because that's something I want to do more now, uh, just to get a bit more building down. So I think this is a jungle tree. I heard a zombie somewhere. No, I didn't. I think I heard a zombie. I might have. Who knows? Uh, so we're just going to punch this down with our wooden axe because we're, you know, we're really living like the stone, like the stone age. Oh, we're living, living the stone age here today. And uh, yeah, it's a fun time in the in the jungle. So is there any, is there any spiders to attack yet? I'm, I'm not seeing any spiders just yet. Oh, an ocelot. Oh, an ocelot. I see an ocelot. I would like to tame the ocelot, but I don't have a fishing rod yet. Uh, another reason why we need spiders, I believe you need string for a fishing rod. I think it's three sticks, two string, or maybe it's two sticks, three string. Uh, but we're going to get a fishing rod done so we can tame ocelots. Uh, there's also a picky over there. We could we could go kill some meat while we wait for... Well, it's not really king meat. Uh, we could go collect some meat while we wait for this to happen. Who knows what we'll do. We'll also draw down this oak tree over here. I believe this is an oak tree. It could be anything, really. Um, and quickly, actually, I'll just, uh, if I move the white wall down and I put this in my inventory, I can check what type of wood it is if my sack No, this is oak wood. That's that's good. I need the planks still uh, for building and stuff because the jungle wood is only for aesthetic building right now because uh, I need the outside of my house to look like jungle wood because uh, it's in a jungle. You know, you've got to have a jungle house if you live in a jungle. It doesn't it doesn't make any sense to have a regular house in a jungle. It just, just doesn't go... With, oh, god damn it. I messed up a little bit. It just doesn't make any sense, you know. Also, I am running dangerously on food. I would really like to see something. I don't know why nothing spawned. It definitely is on normal. Um, I guess uh, my main guess would probably be that nothing can spawn because of the fact they're in a jungle and stuff can't spawn on leaves maybe. Uh, either that or maybe just the first night there's less mobs for some reason. I I remember that being something that was going to happen at some point. I don't know if it ever did. Um, but you know, who knows. Um, so we're going to head back to the house now. We're going to get that working properly. Uh, fortunately, there isn't any spiders we can, you know, craft a bed from, so we're just going to have to, you know, build through the night or, you know, continue to work through the night. But that's just a simple little concern we can worry about later, I guess. Uh, ooh, we're going to have to eat this, these two apples now because of the dangerous hunger level. See, I, I stopped it right in time. I uh, ate the meat by accident, but whatever. So now we're back at reasonable work. Uh, levels we're going to try and just uh, not sprint places uh, just stay at walking pace because uh, if you don't know sprinting wastes a lot more uh, hunger than walking because uh, you know sprinting in real life wastes a lot more energy than walking um, in real life I wish there was like a super sprint the body could oh god damn it because uh, uh, right now you can walk pretty much on autopilot like I, I don't know if that's everyone or if it's just me but like walking doesn't really take any energy like I can do it for hours and it doesn't really affect me uh, but doing stuff like um is this jungle wood? This is jungle wood. Uh, but like, you know, sprinting really takes it out of you. Like, I, I don't know if like long t distance sprinters still get that, but I'm pretty sure they- Oh, Creeper. Hello, Mr. Creeper. But I'm pretty sure they do. Um, so I'm, I'm thinking maybe, maybe we invent a something or maybe, you know, I, I wish there was something where we could get like a super sprint that takes all your energy, uh, but allows you to get from place to place really quickly, like quick, quicker than like current athletes. Uh, you know, I'm just saying, human body, make that happen. I, I don't know who to who to speak to about getting the human body improved, but whatever. Um, so I think we'll go one more this way, and then one more the other way, then we'll start curving around because that that sort of covers the tree a little bit and gives me room to breathe with at the same time. Um, because breathing room is good. Like breathing is always a good thing. Just a another little pro tip from Toy Cat to you. This one's for free, of course. Uh, breathing is good. You you should do it as much as you uh you know can find the time to do it because it's it's good and stuff. Maybe uh, that's just just something I heard on the internet. Could be complete nonsense. You know you don't you don't always have to trust these crazy strangers on the internet. But I I figured I would for this one. Uh, so yeah, let's. This this is what my house is looking like right now. It's it's I don't know, I'm I'm liking the idea right now. It's just a matter of how I get all of this logistic stuff working. But that's that's uh, simple enough stuff to do. So I don't know why I haven't seen anything but that one creeper. Uh, I guess that means it's safe to go mine because uh, I do need a tiny bit of stone. Uh, at least just to do a stone rush because well not a stone rush really at this point because we're 50 minutes into the game. Uh, but just because I really want to get you know some tools done and stuff. So what I could do 
is I was I was contemplating hollowing out the tree, but it's only four way. So you can't do that. I heard something and I thought it was a creep, by the way, if you're wondering why I just uh, saw froze. I was like, oh no! You're not a creep. Oh, those those guys are bad, if you don't know. You know, they, they kind of blow up your stuff. It's not very nice. So I'm going to make this my mining island for now. Because uh, it it's a nice island. It's It's got protection. Um, oh, there is a skeleton. I do not have my sword out for some reason. I don't know where my sword is. Let's quickly... Okay, there it is. Uh, so I hide behind the tree. Uh, we're a little low on health, so we have to... Okay, I think we got this. Uh, we're just going to jump out. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Come on. Oh, God. Can we? Yes. Okay, so now we're on super low health. Another skeleton will kill us. Uh, so we have to be really careful about what we do. Okay, and then there's another skeleton spawns. Um, please don't tell me you can see me. No, no, don't, 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 don't. Okay, I'm not going to kill that chicken. I can't. Uh, what we're going to do for food is we're going to kill that pig, and then we're going to try and uh, chop down all the oak trees we can to uh, get sustenance. Uh, because oak trees will drop apples one every not very often, but it's a bad... Ooh, I think that pig might have dropped two pork chops. Uh, but it's better, you know, strategy than to just uh, do nothing. Also, I have enough jungle wood now to build an actual jungle tree, because if you don't know, it takes four jungle wood saplings uh, rather than just uh, one, like regular trees. Um, so yeah, we're very close now. We just need one more bit of food. So we'll use the... We can't use the sword, actually. That'd be a waste. It's not really a waste, because the sword actually is faster than um, uh, just regular old... Uh, what do you call it? Hitting people, but it is still... It's, you know, it takes two hits instead of one, and it's its just a little messy in my opinion. So, let's see what wood we got here. Was this jungle wood? Oh, this was a jungle wood tree, so this isn't the type of tree I want to chop down. Uh, you want me to chop down the oak tree, is because they drop apples. Which, by the way, uh, the reason they did that is so they have their own little unique charm now. Because uh, before, uh, if, at the moment, like, oak trees used to be the only tree, and then they added birch, and it's like they're sort of equal, but then after that they added... Uh, like spruce and jungle which are really cool so now oak trees are really cool because they drop apples that's their little thing so you know just in case you're wondering uh, that's the logic behind it I do I need some food I, just, I don't know how I'm gonna get the food so I'm just gonna dig down and try and get the uh... Ooh, what's this oh it's some form of sapling uh, so yeah I'm just gonna try and dig down and get my uh, you know thingy sorted uh, because that's that's an easier girl to have for right now so here's our little yeah, here's our little digging down place. We're going to have to do a clever little, uh, you know, digging down system. Not digging down. I, I keep saying it wrong, but because uh, we only have five blocks to work with, I'm only doing it here because it's safe, by the way. Uh, we're going to have to do it cleverly like this, or at least semi-cleverly. And uh, then we should be at least so somewhat safe. Can we dig this block or will this be water everywhere? No, there won't be water everywhere. Uh, so now we can have lots and lots of stone and dig down at the same time. Uh, we only really need enough stone for a furnace as well as its own tool. So maybe 15, 15 stone will be good. I, I, I think we can trust 15 stone to get us through the night. And uh, then it's, it's going to be really tense as we have to get back to the house without dying while we're on one heart and uh, not regenerating. So... I don't know what my strategy is. I guess wait for a thing to burn. Even though we're in a jungle, so everything won't just burn. Uh, it's, you know, it's what I have to do. It's what I have to do. Uh, so, let's try and look for other sources of food. There is apparently a tree here, or at least loads of, uh, there's loads of leaves here for some reason. I don't know what type of leaf they are. Uh, if there's, oh, there is a tree down here. So we're going to chop this tree down, and if it's wood, oak, it is, oh no, it's jungle, damn it. I don't know, I, was this a tree? Just a one high tree sitting there? Because I don't know what house was happening there. Uh, I would just pretend... Ooh. Oh no, that's my house. <laughs> I was like, ooh, what's up there? That's interesting. Oh, we can eat the zombie flesh, assuming there's no skeleton there, which there is. Uh, and he's, aim he's staring at me. I don't know if he actually is staring at me or if he's just in my direction, coincidentally. Uh, but I just want to get away from him and out of his eyesight range. And then kill either this... Oh, this... Oh, piggy, piggy. Into the water. Into the water, piggy. Piggy, I need you. Please. Okay, he's not. He's not He's not listening to me, apparently. I, apparently, that's not what people do in Minecraft. People will not, apparently, that's not what people in Minecraft do. Or sh piggies in Minecraft do. Uh, we'll kill the sheep as well, because we need his wool. Uh, we've got the third and final sheep, though we're getting dangerously close to that skeleton from earlier. Uh, so, we're going to kill him as well. And now we can sleep through tomorrow's and yay. Um... Now we just have to guarantee we won't die. Uh, we do have another pork chop, but we if we get to a furnace, we can cook it. So we just need to get back to our house, fine, and we can get to regenerating, which... I guess we also have cocoa beans there, but I think you need wheat for cocoa beans now, so... I mean, I mean cocoa cookies now. Uh, so I'm not sure if that's actually as viable as they figured it might be. Uh, but all I want to do is just get back there without dying, although it's really dangerous going through the jungle because there is so much shade. Um, 
and also it's just I'm at a really low point in the jungle. I don't know how to get up without damaging myself. So we could just we might have to set up a furnace down here, unfortunately, because there is more stone here to mine, and uh, then cook our food and uh, finish the episode on our regeneration. Because I want you guys to be with me while I regenerate my health and stuff. So you know, I'll go down. oh, oh, that was that's dangerous. I am I am so di I I'm living on the edge right now, basically. And I'm just trying to kill a chicken, uh, a really resistant chicken, I might... Oh, just let me... There we go. <laughs> so now we're going to make ourselves a furnace. We're going to make charcoal if you want, or we're just actually going to fuel it with uh, wood for now if you're wondering. Uh, so actually we need to make another crafting bench. Let's uh, quickly make that happen. Another crafting table down here on the ground. Uh, make ourselves this... Fable. Actually we could take the furnace with us, uh, because they can, they can just be simply mined. Uh, then we're going to put just uh, five... You know, put one, two, three, four, five. That'll be done. Uh, and then we're just going to cook the raw pork chop, that will get us almost all the way, then we can eat the chicken, and bam, we'll be there, and we'll be happy because we'll be alive, so, in the meantime, while this cooks, we'll go and mine some of this stone, uh, because it's going to take a while, actually, I'll probably waste it all right now, but we'll just get some stone anyway, because we need to replace it for more stone tools, because uh, I underestimated how much I had, 12 isn't enough for all of it, so we'll just uh, dig into the mountain a bit here, uh, we can make like a fake little cave, not a fake cave, but we can make a the start of some form of cave here. Uh, I don't. I don't know completely what I'm doing here. I just. I just. You know. It. It looks sort of nice having a little tunnel. Uh, I could make a tunnel going the entire way through because that's just a fun idea. There's. There's so many ideas. My idea is just. Um, no, I'm not, my brain. See, I, my my brain is mistaking itself for an idea. That's how full of ideas it is. Um, this going to be fun to complete them all in this uh, title update 12 Let's Play, uh, which I hope you join me in the next episode of, because I think that will be fun and good. Uh, so yeah, join me next episode for whatever I do then. Uh, I don't know what I'll be doing. As always, uh, you can leave comments and I read them all, so if you have any cool ideas, I will take them on board and probably do them if they're good enough. Uh, so yeah, leave any ideas if you have any. Uh, like the video if you did like it. This is my first Let's Play back, and a lot of people weren't watching my Let's Plays before, so hopefully if you want to support it, like, like it, share it, do whatever you can to help get the video out there and stuff. It would be very, very appreciated if this series did good, because I really want to do it, and I really enjoy Let's Plays. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.